skipping the multi-man match. They got up, Yuji Nagata, Blue Justice versus Minoru Suzuki. They exchanged forearms like crazy all the time. Suzuki did crap out of the ref, trying to use weapons, trying to kill the ref so that he would be able to use the weapons. Submissions, he used submissions of the guardrails, submissions into the steel poles. He probably did that stuff against the ref to, the ref probably let it happen so that, because of the importance of the New Japan Cup, Nagato worked on the arm a lot. Then Suzuki got a sleeper. Then he attempts to go to the gotch pile driver with it feels like three minutes. Uh, Counter into a backdrop, which, which I don't know, it could have been, they could have, It didn't look like a very powerful one, so I don't think Suzuki would have fell down. And then there was a bunch of strikes, a bunch of forearms. And out of nowhere, Yuji Nagata hits the T-bone suplex. Taz, Taz Plex Sal. Suzuki got, gets back up right away. Dodges a clothesline. Reverses into a sleeper. Then the guy out of nowhere hits a backdrop driver roll up for the win. I don't think the right guy won, but that was a very good quality match. Probably the guy was best in a while. And he's definitely capable of it. I don't know why they don't do it. He's definitely better than Shamrock. He's like Segura good. As charismatic as Segura. Uh, he has a lot of boring moves, but like he's sort of like uh, the guy from AGBW, Kendo Mihara, where it's quite a strength and athleticism, but like if, it feels like when Brook Flair does the, the vertical suplexes and stuff, like you can never get tired of it. It does still have that amateur background, but it's a good way to thought to subscribe.